Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Mandy. Thank you so, so much for being here. If you are new, welcome. I hope that you'll stick around, hit that red subscribe button and become part of our family. So the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty just happened and I finally got everything that I ordered from the sale and then some. It is in a Sephora box but that's because I have a bunch of different envelopes in here. So we have quite a bit to go through. Um, so we're gonna jump right into it. But like I said, I just wanted to show you everything that I did get from the sale. I love these sales and I look forward to them twice a year. So getting started, we will just start pulling envelopes. And a lot of these envelopes only have like one or two things in them because I got them, you know, during the day of the sale. So the first envelope I am pulling out, these were $6. I definitely remember that. And they are the KKW Beauty Island, or Lip Liners. So I got Nude 0 0.5, Nude 1, and Pink 1. So definitely excited to have these. I love these liners and for six bucks, what? Okay. First envelope done. Second envelope, we have a couple things in here. Okay, that's empty. So why is that? Did I get all this on the same day? I thought I got these from my ColourPop order. I'm pretty sure I did. So I'm gonna actually put these aside for when I film that ColourPop haul. Um, but what was in this bag were MAC blushes. So these went on sale. I forget how much they were. I think they were half off. So I definitely had to get two of them. So I got Blush Baby, which is a little bit darker kind of color. And then we have Flower Power, which is a little bit pinker. So this one's more mauve and that one's more pink. So excited to add those to my collection. Next bag. Like I said, there's only like a, a few items in each bag because it was what was for sale that day. So, why I have a Dior thing in there, I have no idea, but there's a little Dior um, smell good thingy. So these are from Jacqueline Cosmetics, and I did buy quite a bit of her other things that I was able to get a hold of, um, the blushing and bronzer pack and the uh, couple high, I think I have like three highlights. So this is the, loose highlighter in hypnotic which i've heard really good things about these and i've not touched this yet so i'm excited but here is the packaging it is in like a little box and it is like a purpley color i'm not going to try to open that right now because i will be here all day trying to get that little sticker off i'm gonna have to get my son to get that off for me but i am excited for this i am looking to order the lightest shade I forget what it's called, but it's the lightest shade and it's been out of stock. So hopefully that will come back in stock and I will order that. I do love her highlights and I use them all the time. And then this one is a baby highlighter in Allstruck. Now these were not on sale, I don't believe. I think I just ordered, I don't know. I don't know how I got these or when I got these. But I got them during that, you know, the sale period. So maybe they just came back in stock and that's why I ordered them. I think that's what happened. Um, but anyway, here is the mini in Awestruck, which is a little like kind of rosy gold color. And I think the minis are perfect. Like if I was able to get minis in all of them, that's what I would have done. Because you don't really need that big one. I mean, if you have a lot of highlighters, you don't. But I do love formula all right next envelope we are running right on through it we have oh the urban decay primer potion i just finished up my um little one that i had of this and this was like 12 bucks so it's a nice product it's nice to have in my collection so i grabbed it last envelope oh okay this is the juvia's eye prep eye prime eye primer so another eye primer i don't think this was in the sale either i could be wrong um but this is color one 
excited to try this. I heard good things about it. I mean, it's a new product, but I heard people like it. So there is what the tube looks like. So I'm definitely going to give this a try the next time I put some eyeshadow on, which will be tomorrow morning. So I will definitely have to let you know how that is. So the rest of the stuff is stuff that I've just bought while I was either in store shopping for the sale or whatever. So, or I ordered because I have a little bag here that was in store. I already threw the box away that I had gotten, but I had picked up two of these to begin with. Then I ended up going back and getting the other three. These are the Moondust Single Eyeshadows. Do I have them all right here? One, two, three, four, five. I do. So here's all the little boxes that they come in. They come in like a little purple kind of box. And I'll show you which ones. I've already went like dug into all of these. I love them so much. So this is Solstice. Um, this is Glitter Rock. I, I absolutely love these. This is Space Cowboy. I know it's kind of hard to see with the lights, but these are really nice. This is Cosmic. And then this is Lithium. So the reason I got these is because Tara Babes, that does her Saturday hauling, she had picked these up and she actually did the same thing that I did. I think she had picked like two up to begin with and then ended up getting the rest of them because oh I just threw one they are that good I absolutely love these these are perfect for being you know like hurrying up in the morning if you have to hurry and get a look on just put some bronzer down on your crease and then put one of these all over the lid and it looks perfect so I love these and I hope they come out with more shades in the moon dust one all right next item I got I haven't tried it yet but I did get it. I have it in two shades. Do I have both the shades here? I do. So I have the Good Apple Foundation. And I got it before everybody like bought all of it. So I managed to pick up the Light 006, which is this one. And the Medium 030, which is that one. I've already dug into this one, as you can see. I haven't tried it on the face. I just basically like swatched it and stuff. I don't know. A lot of people are saying it's good at first and it's good for filming. So maybe I'll use it for that. We'll see. It was expensive and I did get two of them and I did get both of them at the same exact time. So it wasn't like I went and got this and it was too dark and I went back because these lighter ones sold out like in the first two days, two or three days, something like that. Anyway, moving on. Okay. Maybe I did get that color pop with this because I have some color pop items in here. All right, well, we'll just show it. So I did pick up some of this Bambi collection. So we have the three cream gel pencil trio, and there is raindrops, meadow, and purely in there. And I love, I absolutely love their eye pencils. Love them so, so much. So here are the three colors that you get, and I love the packaging on it. You guys, amazing. So happy with that. And then this one is, oh, I have a second. How did I manage to do that? So I didn't, maybe I guess I didn't realize that it was in this package, but I have purity again. I guess it's purity. Yeah, purity. So I have another one. <laughs> then I did pick up one of the Cheek Do, um, and this is in, pss. so I haven't tried it yet. I haven't really tried anything but the, pretty much the Moon Dust and, the next thing I'll show you here next. Here is what that looks like. I've heard good things about it. Pretty much when I bought this, a lot of the colors were sold out. So that's the one that I managed to get my hands on. The next item that I was saying that I've already used is the Ultra Creamy Tarte um, Shape Tape, which I really, really like this. I've been using it every day. This one is 12N right here. And this is the one that I've been like really liking and then this is 20s light sand so i did pick up two because i wasn't sure which shade i would use but as of right now i really like this lighter shade and i've been like every day that's what i have on right now love it absolutely love it um the rest of the bambi collection i guess i should show you that i have 
we have a luxe gloss in bambi i love this packaging it's going to be so hard to throw away this packaging they had to make it so stinking cute didn't they and then here is the package it is adorable and i do like their luxe glosses then i do have all of these i don't know when i purchased them like i don't know if i've showed you but i do have all these little palettes this one is bambi i guess that was the one that i was missing it's more of like a neutrally kind of shade look the packaging just is amazing on these and then here is the color story very pretty very neutral and then i did get the bambi falsies oh dear okay so these are the oh dear lashes i've never tried color pops lashes so this is a first for me and i think they're really pretty so i'm excited for that never tried these lashes i might fall in love with them okay we are coming down to the end of the box so we have the nyx high glass um I think it's Tara Babes, or is it? No, this was, who made me buy this? Who is that? There's a, who is the person that made me buy this? I can't remember. I know there's a couple people that really, really like this. So I picked it up. I haven't used it yet, um, but I'm excited to try it. The NYX High Glass and... It's in Moon Glow. Then I picked up another NYX Lift and Snatch. I think I picked up the wrong shade. It's in Brunette. And I think I need a shade darker than this one. I don't know. I'll have to look and see. But these are amazing and I absolutely love them. The next item is Uma Beauty's Palette in Savage. And so stinking pretty. I love the artwork on these palettes. I want to get the Coming to America ones. We'll see. Here is what the palette looks like. It is so pretty and so dark. It's more of a winter kind of palette, but I just had to have it when I seen it and I picked it up. Very, very pretty. I love that silver. Absolutely love that silver. So pretty. I can't wait to use this. I haven't used it yet, but I can't wait to use it. And it looks like there is one more thing in here, and I was so excited to get this. I used my 20% off coupon, and it I had the, because you get them every once in a while, randomly, and it, you were allowed to use it on Prestige brands, so I picked up a full-size Nest Candle in Grapefruit. You guys, these things are so expensive. They're $44. Um... So don't get them unless you get a coupon that you're able to use on them. Uh, right now, the Sephora sale is going on. Unfortunately, I think by the time you see this video, it won't be. But that's a good time to grab these is during the Sephora sale. Um, but these are amazing candles. The scent throw is beautiful. And I am so excited to finally have a full size because I've only used the little guys. So I'm really excited to have this. So, so happy. So... That was my Ulta, basically what I got during the 21 Days of Beauty haul. What did you guys think? Did you Have you tried any of some of these products that I did get? And I want to know your thoughts. So, thank you so, so much for being here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave me a comment down below. Have a fantastic day, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!